We'll guide you through how you can add MP3 files to the music app on your iPhone. If you find this useful, consider subscribing and leaving a like, and let's get right into this. To add MP3s or music files to the music app on your iPhone, you are going to go and need to use a computer. So in this case, I'm doing this guide on a PC. You can do it on Mac, the steps are slightly different. So I'll be primarily doing this for PC. What you first need to do is go and open up or get the iTunes app. If you don't already have it on your computer, you can get it from the Microsoft Store. So click on search at the bottom, type in Microsoft Store, it should pop up quite quickly. And in order to download apps from the Microsoft Store, you are gonna need to be signed in with a Microsoft account. I'm already signed in, but if you aren't, go and sign in by pressing in the top right on that icon, and then just go and search for iTunes like so. And here it is, click on it, and there's going to be a get button where mine says open. So press get, and you can then go uh, and download it. Once you've downloaded it, then you go and press open, just like this. It'll take a moment to launch. Inside of iTunes, go to the top left to make sure music is selected, and then under library, make sure songs is selected. Then what you need to do is go and add the MP3 files which you want on your iPhone into iTunes. To do that, you just go and press on file, and then go and press on add file to library, or if you've got an entire folder of MP3s, click there as well. Your file explorer will then open and you can select the song. So I've selected it there and then I'll go and click on open. And there it is in my library in the songs. Go and add all the songs you want to go and sync. And then what you need to do is go and connect your phone to your computer. To do that, you just need the USB and lightning cable. So unplug it from your power adapter, plug one end into your computer and the other end into your phone. When you go and connect it for the first time on your iPhone, you may go and get a pop-up saying something like allow this device to connect. Make sure you press allow. As you can see in the bottom right, it's connected. It says Apple iPhone. And I've actually had this pop-up here on iTunes. I'll press cancel for now. But in the top left of iTunes, just to the right of music, you can then go and see this phone icon appear. So go and click on that there. And then what you need to do is go over to the left and go and click on music. And then you want to go and select sync music like this. And I just got this pop up here. It says, are you sure you want to remove existing music? In this case, I'll press remove and sync like that. And that's now done. Then what you can do is go and press apply. And then I'll go and press sync and replace like this. And there we go. Now what it's going to do is go and sync all of that music we just went uh, and added to our iTunes. As you could see, it said copying. And now on my iPhone, I'm just gonna go into the um, Apple Music app or the music app and just go and show you the song. So here we are, I'll go and open up music, go to library, and there we go. The DJ quads and the Burst of June um, audio file is there. And as you saw at the start of this video, they were the MP3 files we added to iTunes. If you found this useful, consider leaving a like. Peace.